Saturday the 18th of December. Now, if ever there was an occasion for the whole of the world's media to gather for the most spectacular of breaking news, it's here surely in Luke chapter 2, verses 10 and 11. Do you remember yesterday we left the shepherds terrified? The angels appeared and the glory of the Lord shone all around. They wonder what on earth's happening. But the angel replies straight away, don't be afraid. I bring you news of great joy that will be for all the people today in the town of David. That's Bethlehem. A saviour has been born, who is Christ the Lord. And yet, of course, there was no world media there. There was nobody there. Well, apart from a bunch of unknown shepherds from we don't know where. They were the only ones that heard this spectacular news. This was God's doing. This was God's way. This was God's plan. And yet this, of course, was 2,000 years ago. How many people have since, though, been shared that news? Hundreds, thousands, millions in the last 2,000 years. Why? Because just like those very first shepherds, as we'll see in tomorrow's devotion, they realise the significance of this. And they realise they cannot keep it to themselves. They've got to go and find out for themselves. But more than that, they've got to tell others. And that's what our job is. Those of us who know and love the Lord Jesus Christ, this is the greatest news we could ever share with the world, whatever the world thinks. I wonder what the world would think actually would be the greatest news of greatest joy that they could hear. Imagine if they were told today, coronavirus has gone, it's been eradicated, it's disappeared. Well, there would be great celebrations, but that is simply not going to happen. What about world debt, world poverty? That's going to be dealt with. We'll get the UN together with some of the World Bank organisations and that's not going to happen. What about the greatest scientists? I mean, some of them but recently, they've done some remarkable things. They're going to get rid of death. That'll never happen. There's only one great news that brings joy for all the people. And that's the a saviour's come to save us from our sins. Or oh, let's be part of sharing that great news with others. Because it's the greatest news of all that brings the greatest ever joy.